a huge welcome to this video. I'm Scorpion from How to Do, and today you will be learning how to make this mini map over here uh, with all of these animations. So you can see that our character ha can be seen over there with the animation like that. All right. So this is the part eight of the GTA series. Let me just quickly check if it is the part eight of the GTA series. Uh, wait a second. Yeah, part eight. So this was the part seven of the cop system. Uh, so this is the part eight for the uh, GTA series. So if you haven't seen the previous videos, go ahead and click the link in the description box below and seen them first because that will help you a lot because we made all of this system in our previous uh, game and this this thing right here is new which I was testing and this wasted thing and all this uh, camera effect and slow motion and that system will be uh, released uh, I guess it will be the ninth part of the GTA series so you will learn that pretty soon uh, but in this video you will only learn how to make this uh, mini map so let me just go ahead and go to the uh, original cop uh, scene for the tutorial because that was my self test <laughs> as you can see cop self test but this is the cop system uh, cop tutorial so let's get started so first thing what you need to do is you need to just go ahead and say right click and add a camera over here rotate the camera 90 degrees from the X so that it's facing downwards and then bring the camera up and on the top of our player all right and there we go on the top of the player right like that pretty pretty awesome there we go and now what I can do is I can just go ahead and simply add some some uh, you know uh, level environment things so that we can distinguish that the minimap is actually working or not so let's just do this kind of thing to make sure that the minimap is actually working so make some obstacles and then go ahead and select all of these and make them navigation uh, static and then go to navigation and first I want to do is I want to just go ahead and reduce the size of the scale and go to bake and bake this so that our policeman can uh, avoid these obstacles all right so the policeman has the nav mesh system which we made in the previous videos if you haven't seen them go ahead click the link in the description box below and see them first all right so where is the camera this guy let's just call this guy minimap minimap and drag and drop this minimap into the player base inside the player there we go and then what we can do is we can go to the uh, projection and set the uh, projection from perspective to orthographic there we go and now we can bring in the camera like this and zoom in using this size scale over here all right and I guess this looks better there we go and now what we can do is we can go ahead and say right click over here create in in the where is it project settings uh, the uh, in the project window say right click create and create a render texture and I will call it mini map texture so uh, select your mini map camera and drag and drop the mini map texture inside the texture target texture there we go and now what that will do is uh, everything that is seen uh, that is shown in the minimap that the minimap camera is uh, capturing from this this is the square that the minimap can capture over here you can see camera preview so everything that can the minimap can see is projected right towards this texture as you can see right here it shows this thing right here all right so that's the pretty much the purpose of doing that let's just go ahead and say right click UI and go to raw image and there you can see this little raw image right here this guy over here and this will be the uh, minimap for us so let me just go ahead and select this this thing uh, and I really don't know how to use this thing this this guy uh, I say bottom and bottom the map oh it's, it's it's over there so let me just bring it a little up there we go you can see that uh, there we go I actually I'm zooming in uh, by 
pressing uh, shift space so you can get inside there over here and get it over here and do that pretty much <laughs> everything all right so you can just go ahead and make this little bigger a uh, little up and I guess that looks good I, I can make it a little bigger also little bigger and yep that that looks much better uh, there we go perfect so now what we can do is we can drag and drop the minimap texture from here to there onto this guy and as you can see immediately you can see this minimap over here and when we play it will actually work believe me or not it'll work you can see there all right but however uh, it looks good it's not that much bad uh, yeah it's working actually great you can see the minimap over there with all, all of the animations and stuff like that however we can make this much better by making it little more bigger uh, like that yep like that and then we can add some boundaries in here so let's just go ahead and say another UI and a raw image and make it little bigger than this one drag it behind that so that we can see that this can be the border and drag and drop the uh, and let's just rename this so this is our mini map and this is our border borders all right so that's that then we can change the color of the border to black there we go okay it should not be in the center because this guy is in the center so let me just go ahead and do that and there we go it's perfect and then we can select the minimap and set it to center and center and there we go it looks perfect all right and there we go it looks like a whole lot of minimap now with all of the animations and stuff like that and it looks pretty awesome and then as you can uh, let me just save this and then come back to the self as you can see there is a black and white thing like this so how to do that uh, let me just come back so to do that you actually need a thing called post processing where is it let me see uh, hey where is the, yep there is it the post processing so you can actually find it in the asset store let me see if that works the asset store works or not so let me just go ahead and search uh, post uh, post processing what's the spelling of processing processing there we go and this one which is free this guy over here it is free it's made by unity as you can see it's free so you have to just go ahead and import that download and import that and then you will see this post processing thing you don't have to do anything with that as you can see i have made these two post processing profiles uh, so you have to say right click create and create a where is it post processing profile and i will call it mini map 1.1 because i have made actually minimap over here somewhere so what you have to do is you have to go to your minimap which is the minimap camera and go ahead and say post processing profile behavior post processing behavior and drag and drop your minimap 1.1 over here and double click this guy so you can see all of these options over here so what can we do we can actually go to the bloom turn that on and uh, uh, no we don't want that bloom uh, we want motion blur I will make a tutorial a whole lot of tutorial on this uh, post processing thing how to make the better graphics and all that stuff but you can say bloom is yeah ambient occlusion occlusion or whatever it is uh, there we go you can see the shadows over here and then we can go ahead uh, say hi and then we can go ahead and go to the color grading so this will actually make it look much better so go to the filmic uh, and go ahead and decrease the saturation to make it black and white if you want it's all up to you then contrast make it little higher uh, tint we don't want any tint uh, if you want you can you can make it a little greenish like a red or well that looks much better let me just go ahead and change them to green so that it looks kind of like uh, a radar it does look like that 
and then we can go ahead and say vignette and grain uh, yep grain yep. now this looks like a radar all right and then we can go to vignette and you can change the intensity from here to there and do everything you want smoothness and all that stuff well that looks much better all right so that was it if we play now you can see it looks kind of a radar uh, working <laughs> okay it, it looks really awesome as you can see and that's that that was the tutorial on minimap hope you guys enjoyed my video if you did then subscribe to my channel which is how to do and yeah that was it hope you guys enjoyed and if you want you can also donate me some money through paypal the link for the uh, money for uh, donating money for paypal is in the description box below uh, all right i will really appreciate if you will donate something to me and yeah that's it hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next video and you guys will be thinking that why i'm not dying over here because i have set it to disabled for this scene only we can die on the next scene uh, uh, all right so let me just save scene and show you guys really quickly this does not look um, good now because we made the red art thing in the previous video so let me just quickly show you with how we can die so this will be the next tutorial this guy we wasted <laughs> uh, all right so this will be the tutorial next tutorial uh, and that will be pretty much released pretty soon so yeah that's it hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next video till then be cool